Molly Burkan, please stand up. And he is the best dressed uh, fire walker I've ever seen in my life. Look like, as I said, an investment banker. Can we look at the bottoms of your feet? <laughs> it's been a while since we've had a call for bare feet on our program. <laughs> my wife said, wash your feet. They may ask you to show your feet. This is kerosene. Because we're doing this during the day, you can't see how deep red and orange these glowing coals are. And so I'm going to throw a little kerosene on here so that your viewers can appreciate the fact that this is very, very hot. All right, fine. Wow. Oh, here goes Tolly. Here goes Tolly. Okay. Ah. It has less to do with the fire beneath their feet and more to do about the fire that burns within their soul. Now, a lot of companies out there, Coke, Microsoft, uh, MetLife, are all starting to use firewalking to get their employees to challenge themselves. Real estate salespeople like Rich Levinson have come to this Remax seminar for tips on how to increase sales. Burkan says if you can walk on fire, selling houses is easy. What I do is I inspire people to use more of their potential. Yeah. All right. What real estate agent breaks boards with his bare hands? Tolly shows them they can. Then Burkan ups really the danger, the Annie, by just... having salespeople snap an arrow with their neck. Yes! Now they're starting to realize it may be possible to do some of these things that I believed were impossible to do. Let's rake out these coals. years, he's trained people to firewalk as a transformational tool and a way to combat fear. Before you learn to walk on hot coals, you have to learn to walk on broken glass. Walking on glass teaches you only one thing, how to pay attention. When you step on the glass, you don't want to put your weight down until you first pay attention to what's going on underneath the sole of your foot. It's not like walking on the fire. When you walk on the fire, there's only one thought in your mind, and that is getting off. The bed of hot timber coals is about 1,100 degrees Fahrenheit. Some physicists say that fire walking is possible because unlike metal, timber coals are poor conductors of heat. But whatever the explanation, the dangers are very real. People have been seriously injured. Do not try this at home.